Hey guys, welcome to Fair Wine. We're back with our Let's Play of Silent Hill 2. This is part 8. Uh, when we last left off... We, uh, oh yeah, we're wandering around the city with Maria. Um, we went to that little dance club. She's obviously being very like flirtatious, inappropriate. Uh, she's a bit unsettling. It's, um... I don't know. But anyway, we said, hey, we're ready to roll. And so... Say, Mama. Let me know when you want to move on. I want to move on now. Let's go. All right, then. Come on. Yeah, she was, like, up there dancing, and she was like, let's take some shots. She was being, like, a party girl, and he's like, bro, I gotta find my wife. You know, I also like, too, I, from, I might have already mentioned this, but I like that he's not wearing his wedding ring, but you can see that there's a, a tan line. We shouldn't have stayed here this long. Hey, it's okay. We're almost there anyway. Good. No more delays. I need to find Mary. Well then, let's hope you will. And you can tell she's like getting like subtly jealous of uh, Mary. Okay. Hey, it was, oh, I thought those were like amps. I was like, hey, it's a band. They were going to be like... Yeah, we're playing a show over at the fucking whatever the place it's called. Heaven's Night. Let's go. Uh, it's over here. I feel like I hear Pyramid Head. It's creeping me out. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I hear him. I hear like the dragon of a night. 23 rounds. I can't remember what other kind of enemies we fight. I think we. Far now. I think it's like we. I think we fought all the enemies that we're gonna fight. Is this a dead end? Yeah. Right. See if there's any bullets or um we do not need med drinks. We're not hurting for that. Oh. Look, we're on the other side of that chasm. Some detour. But hey, at least we're here. Here meaning where, exactly? Come on, you'll find out. I love that she's being so cryptic. It doesn't, it doesn't make it creepy at all. your death. It's like, oh, cool. Maria, can't you just be a straight shooter? That's it? A garden? There's a bit more to it than that. If you say so. I don't think I've been here before. Come on. She's just around the corner. Huh? She? story told around these parts kind of a local legend it tells of a woman who was cast out sentenced to die on an island out on the lake there was a man in town who 
so madly in love with her. <laughs> and every night, he would sneak out, row across the lake, bringing her food and company. <laughs> and every night, she would stand there on the shore, holding a lit candle to help him find his way. But this one night, a terrible storm broke out, caught him out in the open, and it blew out the candle. Even in darkness, the man would not give up. He would not turn back. So he fought against the raging waters until finally the lake took him. They say even then, the woman never lost hope. She kept coming out at night, kept lighting the candle to bring her beloved home, to lead him to shore. <laughs> Not sure how much truth there is to it. It's probably just a fairy tale. Sounds like it, yeah. But she's become something of a local saint, a patron of undying love. Hence this place. She's starting to get pissed. She's not here. What? She's not here. And why would she be? I don't even remember this place. This was a mistake. I shouldn't have come here. I don't think he's talking about this area. I think he's talking about Silent Hill, period. It's okay. There's plenty of other places to look. We can still... What the hell is that? Come on. came from inside the theater. Okay, we might have to go through that window, right? Yep. Oh, shit. No, I don't remember the theater at all. I don't know if that's a new area or if that's from the original. But here we go. You okay? Oh. Yeah. Maybe you better wait here. Okay. Not much of a movie fan anyway. Is I sure? That's... And James? Yeah. Be careful in there. Yeah. Sounds like Eddie and Laura. Especially when I do something bad. Did you do something bad? You know, so the cops are angry with you? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, let's keep moving. So why don't you just say you're sorry? You always I remember, uh, I do remember. Did you hear that too? Oh. ran
Yeah, I could have sworn the next time I saw him was like, like the bowl of rama. He's like eating pizza at the bowling alley. Maybe that's not in this game. out yet yeah I just didn't get around to it yet oh. at least you got your appetite back oh you have six pence to that are you alone here Eddie Probably just Laura messing around. The little girl? Laura, is that her name? That's what she said. I'm gonna go look for her. You coming? Now you want me to come with you? Oh. Never mind. Um, and I, I, I was going to comment on it before because I did notice it when he was in the bathroom. But you can see his breath whenever he talks. I wonder what the significant of that, significance of that is. So it's a bit of Who is ass. that girl, anyway? I don't know. All I know is her name. I swear. Okay, just like you didn't kill that dude in the apartment? Sure. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I could have sworn like uh, in the original, you like meet him in the bowl of ramen, he's eating pizza, and you make a comment about him like, how can you fucking eat when <clears throat> there's monsters everywhere? You fat piece of shit. Just kidding. Excuse me. Oh, what was it? This is on the counter. More bullets. Sweet. I was kind of bummed out that I burned through all that ammo on Pyramid Head when it seemed like all I had to do was wait them out. Did I just hear something? Mm. Right, doors are locked. There's no game. So we need to get up to the projector room. Now I played out on Wake 2 not too long ago, so maybe I can <laughs> maybe it's the same layout. Doubtful. was running around the, the, the actual theater, so maybe there's a way to get up there from there. Love all that classic Silent Hill music. Pretty great. I forgot what soundtrack I used to have, but um, I think it was Silent Hill 3. 
I think it was Silent Hill 3. And I used to jam it all the time. Laura? Laura, come on down here. So I've been a twat. There we go. Some drawers. Nothing fucking in them. And she has her, you can see her breath too. Did you ever see James's? Or even a Maria's. I haven't <sighs> seen Maria's breath either. Or am I tripping? Let's see. I see, I don't see his breath. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Come on, Laura. Let's work together here. How do you know fucking Mary? You make some stupid comment like that and just run off. Laura, stop! It's dangerous! A little girl yeah I tried to stop her but she went that way we can still catch her all right Maria Porque? let's see you know she went lie down this way or I just bored it off okay yeah Which way am I supposed to be going? Maria. Doesn't feel like it's getting icy now, right? Or maybe not. You start doing like shattered memories and just start building up James, the ice in the air. Oh, the hospital. Oh no, the nurses. <laughs> oh shit. Brookhaven, bless you. Okay. Is that a gun cabinet in a hospital? Yeah, but it's empty. There's a shotgun here books. somewhere. Yeah, hey, 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 hey. we're gonna get a shotgun soon. Ah. Anyway, kind of sing song bullshit. Where 
Where did she go? I don't know. Let's look around. Nothing in there. All right. The director requested the files of the three crucial patients. You know which ones. Could you please bring them to his office? I think I said bring them to his office. <laughs> <laughs> a draft. Draft here. Looks like there is a key in there. No combination though. Hmm. We should look around. Might be written down somewhere. She's the world's greatest detective. Um Sure is a creepy hospital. <laughs> I mean, at least he's not in here by himself. Like, not that it really fucking matter. But. I'd be creeped out if I was here all alone. I don't know why I keep getting sing song with that. I'm just tired. Ah, <laughs> oh, map perfect. Padlock. Oh, I just realized, too, the little squares mean that that's a safe spot. I'm surprised I don't have something a little more uh, indicative. Okay. Noise. 15 health drinks. <laughs> the threat of death is non existent in this game. And I'm glad it's, I uh, like. It's weird how from simple to normal they like were not giving me nearly as much. You were just taking so much more damage. But also, it feels like I'm not getting hit as often because. Yeah. Okay, write that down. Door's locked. Experience poor appetite, significant weight loss, insomnia, hypersomnia, uh, loss of interest or pleasure in unusual or loss of interest or pleasure in usual activities, feeling of worthlessness or guilt, diminished abilities to think or concentrate, contact your health care. Sounds like depression. There. Laura, wait. It's okay. We don't want to hurt you. God damn it. For someone who's like, oh, I get in love, Mary. And I don't think she likes me very much. But why? I, uh, I don't know. Um. Yeah, you figured that Maria looks exactly like Mary. So you figure she'd be like, oh my god, like, it's Mary. But no, she's just a twat. Alright, let's continue checking this floor before we move on to another one. We're actually just about running out of time anyway. No power. What was that? Not sure. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't. Stay on your guard. 
Maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Five syringes. Combination key for the key locker is two eight, the total number of nurses in the lobby photo. Ah. Cool. Well, I might be able to open that. Here soon. Oh, more shotgun shells. Nice. Can't break that one, huh? So whatever we pissed off earlier, I was trying to piss it off more. <laughs> I already did that. All right, let's head back downstairs. Oh no, where are we? we are downstairs. What am I talking about? Nurses. All right, nurses in some fucking photo. Those are doctors. Oh, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You looking for something in these photos? Yes. I am one. So the note was two eight seven. Yeah, no, I'm thinking the same thing. <laughs> I'm like, oh, cool. All right, guys, so that's going to be the end of part eight of our Let's Play of Silent Hill 2. We'll be back with part nine very soon and see what the hell's down in the basement. I'm sure it's nothing but good things that will help us sleep at night. Anyway, guys, till next time. Peace.